It's really hot and humid this morning. Very hot. So at and is coming today for the third time to do the installation of the internet. So we'll see how that goes. And um, there's, there's mommy. Yeah, that was my train right there. But, oh well, there's always the next one. So I didn't bring my lunch today, so I'm gonna go over here and check out this noodle place. So last night I was watching a YouTube channel called This Is Me. He's a daily vlogger in Canada and he's a health coach or learning to be one. He, he makes daily vlogs about his life and he's done it for the past 195 days, which is a really long time because I kind of know I've been writing since January to every single day to make about that much time. Now writing is a lot easier than doing videos. You know, just make the commitment and show up. It's 15, 20 minutes, something like that. But doing videos takes a tremendous amount of time. Shooting all the video, preparing what you're gonna say, copying the footage, you know, backing up the footage, organizing files, editing the audio, video, uploading large format files. So all this creates a huge amount of work. If there are things that you wanna create in this world, then you're gonna find that there's like challenges that go along with it. And there's stuff, you know, books written about the topic of resistance, about how most people give up, they stop working on something once they reach that period of resistance. But if you can push through all the resistance, then you'll see real success. And it's almost like this is a law for the whole universe, you know. There's, um, there's, there's difficult things, important things that we all face with some form of resistance. And you have to know um, it's gonna come and not be surprised when it does actually show up. You have to recognize it for what it is and find the strength to push through it, find a way to move through the resistance. And it might be stepping to one side and shifting in a direction slightly. It might mean taking a whole new direction, you know, pausing or learning something new to overcome it. And you could, could be something so large that it feels impossible to overcome. And I've, I've hit this resistance with pretty much every single project that I've ever worked on. And if you push through it, you'll eventually make it through that challenge, but you have to really push hard to make it through. You have to really go after what it is you want. And once you build that momentum, this is what I, he was talking about, once you build that momentum, things start to open up for you. There'll be more opportunities and more doors that open. So the resistance will still appear every single step of the way, but there'll be more momentum behind you, so you'll be able to recognize it for what it is, expect it, and if you meet the resistance, it's a good thing. It means that what you're doing is important. It's worthwhile pursuit. You gotta move through it, come out of the other side to meet the next challenge, because you know it's waiting for you. Pursue something that matters to you, something important to you, and push through that resistance, and don't stop. Sirens are going off for some reason in Marta, I don't know why. Sounds drunk. And this is a special episode, so it's a little longer than normal. <laughs>